Pardon me, is everything all right? No, no, it's not. We only had two bells to go, but she just had to go and spoil things. I'm afraid I don't follow. Who spoiled things? Also, what bells? <sighs> Professor Black ordered Mr. Moon to take down the bells in the bell tower. Said they were giving him a headache. Those bells are a part of Hogwarts. I wasn't about to let that happen. So, I asked my friend Adelaide to help me put them back. We've always been a duo of sorts, Adelaide and Evangeline. Addie and Evie. Anyway, it was going swimmingly until Black started asking questions. Then she wasn't comfortable with our rule breaking. Now I'm stuck, unable to tell which bell goes where. Perhaps I could help put the bells back up. Really? Oh, that would be wonderful. The bells are in the bell tower just above the music room. You're certainly of more help than Adelaide. I imagine the bells are just inside the bell tower. This looks like the portrait from the map. Now, where's the treasure? Revelio. Ah, the bells must be upstairs. up there somehow. Wingardium Leviosa, perhaps. Wingardium Leviosa! Revelio!
Nakamura. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. The bells are back up, Evangeline. Ah, oh, you're a credit to the school. I can't wait to hear them. I can't wait for the headmaster to hear them. I wish I could see his face. Future generations may not truly appreciate what you've done, but I do. And I hope that you do as well. You don't know how much this means for me and for Hogwarts. <laughs> 